Hi guys, how you doing? This is Q coming to you again with another video from DIY Genesis. And in today's tutorial, I really just want to talk about navigation and how to control the menus inside of the magazine pro theme. So as you can tell here, when you look at my example site that I have set up here, you can see the primary navigation here. But when you look at the secondary navigation, it's not much there. There's just block examples. So when we go look at the actual Magazine Pro demo theme, you can see how elaborate this menu structure is, how they build out the primary and the secondary navigation. Now, we're going to go through and do something very similar just to show you the power that's actually available inside the menu structure. So let's just jump into the back office and we're going to talk about that so as you can tell i've already gone to appearance and then menu and so now we're in the menu section here and we're ready to talk about how do we structure this so if you notice here this says before header menu well if you go back this section here is the before header menu section so we'll go back again so now when we start talking about that secondary navigation this secondary navigation is actually called after header menu. So when we go back, we'll show you really quick here when we jump in. Right now, if you look at this information, it's showing the footer menu is the after is in the after header menu location. Now you can see that in this drop down navigation, but let's go to the manage location where you will really see that's exactly what it is. So see, just like it said, before header menu is the showing the before header menu. After header menu is showing the footer menu. So we want to change that. So let's just change that to header menu one. And then we'll just hit save changes. So now when we go back, what we'll see in the drop down is we'll see now header menu is the after header menu. So when we go and look at our the front of our site, when we refresh, we should see that change. Now, as you can tell, this is showing a different structure of menu items on our secondary menu, the after header menu. So now if we go back into our menus, there are a few other things that we can do. So let's just go and play around and go to the after header menu and section. And we're going to hit select. And what this is doing is allowing us to select just the after header menu. So this is saying, I'm only going to concentrate and focus on working on the after header menu. I'm not dealing with the before header menu at all right now. So here are the items that are in that before header uh, or the after header menu. So if you go here, you can remove these. You can take these out as you want to. And we'll do that and then we'll hit save menu that's important to make sure you do that so that you actually save your updated changes so when we go to the home page again and we refresh we'll see now just like in that menu we only see home and about us so what else can we do Q well great question here's something else we can do so very powerful very interesting so let's just say you had some categories for blog posts and you had airlines let's say hotels and car rentals and we want to add those to the menu so we're going to add those to the after header menu so now if you need to drive specific things based on the categories of your post you can put that right in your navigation which is super powerful and gives you a great way to drive your customers right where they need to go if it's specific information that they're trying to get to so we hit save menu again and then when we go to our main home page, we refresh, you see right there, airlines, hotels, and car rentals. So guys, I just wanted to show you just how powerful this is, how easy it is to go about setting up this navigation. And I hope you found value in this video. I really am excited about what we're doing here in 2020. Please make sure you hit that subscribe button, the like button, um, please make sure you hit the notification bell to get notified every time we're doing new content and new videos. And please let me know in the comments if there's other things you want to see, if things that are more involved that you want to see, then I certainly would be willing to shoot those videos as well. So again, guys, until next time. 
This is Q coming to you from DIY Genesis.